Hello tech support fans, this is Paul, one of the techs from MicroSanta, and today we're going to take a look at a possible error when you're installing MiSET. It's error 2878, and we're going to show you how to solve that problem. Let's get started. All right, you may get this error when you're trying to install ESET. It's error 2878. The installer has encountered an unexpected error in installing the package. This may indicate a problem with the package. Uh, typically what this indicates is that there are either traces of a previous antivirus on your computer or or there is an actual previous antivirus on the computer. It's rather easily fixed however what you need to do is go into save mode to fix it. What we want to do is go ahead and open up the internet and go to ESET's website and download the ESET uninstaller. Go to ESET.com and in the search window type ESET uninstaller. Hit enter. Okay that's the one we want. How do I manually uninstall my Windows ESET product? So go ahead and click on that. Okay, the second the second choice is the uh, the uninstaller for Windows. So go ahead and click on that. Download ESET uninstaller, and then I'm going to save as so I can just throw it right on the desktop so that we can easily get to it. All right, so that's finished. But as I said before, you can't run this in regular mode, so you have to run it in safe mode. So we're going to have to reboot the computer into safe mode. And the easiest way to get to safe mode from Windows 8 is to right-click and select Run and type msconfig. Hit OK. And then go to the second tab, Boot, click Safe Mode. And then also make sure Network is uh, selected, because that will put you into safe mode with networking, which will allow you access to the Internet. Now, you do have to remember when you're finishing safe mode, you also want to run an MS config to, uh, to uncheck these settings. So now we're going to reboot and we'll be in safe mode. Okay, so we're in safe mode and there's the ESET uninstall tool. We want to go ahead and click that. It's going to ask you if you really want to continue. Go ahead and say yes. And this actually works with any other antiviruses. It's not just an ESET uninstaller. So if you say yes here, it'll go ahead and tell you exactly what other antiviruses are on your system. It's scanning, so it looks like it found one. Uh, if there's if there's more than one, it would have one number one, and then it would have a number two, and that listed there as well. So we just want to hit number one and hit enter, and have it remove it, and then it will ask you if we want to uninstall. Go ahead and say yes, and then press any key to exit. Now we want to make sure that it reboots back into regular mode so right click and go to MS config go to boot uncheck safe boot and then hit OK and now the computer is going to restart in regular Windows mode so from here you can go on and proceed with the install of ESET and you should not get that 2878 and everything should just proceed normally if you have any other questions come visit us at www.microcentertech.com or visit our no wait chat service at chat.microcentertech.com